Watch this before you go no contact with the narcissist. When you decide to go no contact with a narcissist, they are not going to be supportive. They are not going to provide you with encouragement or emotional help. They are not going to be understanding because they are at a different level of awareness. They lack empathy, so they're not going to understand what you're going through. And you don't need to make them understand. You need to come to a place of acceptance. You need to accept that they're on their own journey. They may experience distress and annoyance. They may be confused. But rather than being frustrated by this, you should be compassionate towards them. You should show sympathy and concern for them. But do not react. Do not feed into it. When you react to the narcissist or argue about it, it will only make the situation more difficult. When you decide to go no contact with a narcissist, you need to practice acceptance. You need to be compassionate. You need to understand that they lack awareness. You need to understand that they're on their own journey. Be the observer. You can watch and observe what happens, but don't have any active part in it. Don't worry about why they're angry. Don't overanalyze the situation and don't try to fight them. When you try to fight the narcissist, they will always fight back. Don't disrupt their natural course of events. Don't try to save them. When people are going no contact with the narcissist, the narcissist will always play the victim. They will always try to make you feel guilty, as though you are abandoning them. And it makes you want to be the hero. It makes you want to change them. But by doing that, you are disrupting their natural course of events. But you also shouldn't be too positive. By being too positive around a narcissist, it will cause disruption. It only causes more drama and chaos. It causes them to react to you. But that doesn't mean that you need to be negative. That doesn't mean that you need to blend in or be a part of their situation. Just be at peace with yourself. Allow yourself to be free from disturbance. Instead of trying to be positive or trying to blend in with them. You don't need to say anything. They are going through their own battle. So give them the time and the space that they need to do that without suffocating them, without making them feel uncomfortable.
go in no contact with the narcissist is a very important thing for you to do in order to level up your health career and your relationships you need to separate yourself from what is holding you back the narcissist is a distraction from your growth and development and separating yourself from the distraction is key to elevating yourself closer to your dreams You cannot make it work with the narcissist. There is no amount of time or space that will resolve this situation. There is no amount of love or understanding that will help them. But you can try to understand things from their perspective and that will also help you to protect yourself. You need to protect your energy. If you are involved in any arguments or disagreements with a narcissist, remember to breathe deeply. Avoid making direct eye contact. This will help you to protect your energy. Instead of trying to change the narcissist, give them the opportunity to learn. If you try to explain anything to them, they're not going to listen to you. They have an exaggerated sense of their own abilities and importance. They think they know more than you do. So there is nothing that you can tell them. You can't just seek out a therapist to help them because they're just going to see it as though you think there's something wrong with them. They will just become defensive. They will become very anxious to challenge or avoid criticism rather than thinking that they need to do the work to change. So instead of doing that, give them the opportunity to figure things out on their own. Give them the time and the space that they need to go through their own battle. Give them the opportunity to learn. That is the only way that they will be able to change their perspective. That is the only way that they will awaken. But that doesn't mean that they will change. In most cases, they will just find someone else and do the same thing again. But the more that you try to control them, you're only going to restrict any potential growth that they might otherwise make. If you try to keep the narcissist in a box where you are constantly trying to restrict their behaviors, you're also limiting their ability to change. Growth requires freedom. So if you really love and care for the narcissist, give them the time and the space that they need to grow. Going no contact with a narcissist isn't easy, but it is a very important thing for you to do. As long as you are with the narcissist, they will only try to control you, which will only restrict your ability to grow. It will only limit your ability to level up your health, career and your relationships. Elevation requires separation. And when you separate yourself from the narcissist, you will find that your life quickly begins to change. You will be able to think for yourself. 
you will be able to make your own decisions and you will have more time and energy to do the things that you want to do. The narcissist will always play the victim and they will try to make you feel guilty for leaving them because they're only thinking about themselves. They don't care about the effect that their behavior has on you. And for once, you need to take a leaf out of their book. You need to start thinking about yourself. Because that is the only way that you are going to remove yourself from this situation. You can be compassionate towards the narcissist, but be compassionate from afar. Instead of being the cameo in your own movie, it's time for you to shine. The narcissist will demand your attention, but after everything you have been through, you need to attend to yourself. You need to give special care and attention to your wounds so that you can heal from this. As long as you are around the narcissist, you will never be able to heal because they always need you to attend to them, which always results in you neglecting yourself. But when you go no contact with a narcissist, you will finally be free. You will finally realize why they're always fighting for your attention, why they're always chasing after you. Because when you give what they're constantly taking from you to yourself, you will realize just how valuable it is. You will realize just how valuable your time and attention can be. When you just give it to yourself. Because that's what's going to help you to move on from this. That's what's going to help you to heal. The things that they're constantly trying to take from you are the same things that you need to heal yourself. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.